Adam, great you're watching. Let's do some bidding on qubits. Um, this is the Dutch version. So maybe you see some remarks in Dutch. Uh, but let's focus on the biddings. Um, partner opens one spade. A bit two clubs. Partner bids two spades. Two clubs is game forcing. So I can slowly just describe my hands. Um, I've got four diamonds, but not really unbalanced. So I will show two now from balanced hands and let's wait for partner what he bids. I'm playing against uh, Bus Driver and Short Brink. So one of the best pairs I think here on Qubits to play against. Three spades. Um, Showing, well, again, just spades. Um, won't be very strong because otherwise uh, it would have been three spades after two clubs. But still, I've got a good hand. And I will show some Q to show slim, inv uh, slim Invitational hand with four clubs. I've got all Qs, so it's a bit tricky. Probably partner will bid four spades. But I'm giving room for partner to bid four hearts last train <clears throat> when partner has something extra. Four diamonds Q. So this is something. So probably partner has a singleton diamonds and diamond or the king. Suppose partner has the king, which is a good card. So I can ask. Well, I can do four hard last train. I can also bid four, four not from myself. Let's uh, just bid four hard last train because it's nice to bid. We can pay in partner to go too high and slim. But of course, I'm joking. Partner, I expect we'll bid four spades and then I will respond with four no. Partner's thinking. So normally you can just bid all the hands and then wait partner to do his part. But now for the uh, recording, I'm just waiting for my partner and uh, bidding this step by step. Of course, of course it's tricky when partner bids five clubs, one key card. So the ace of spades. Uh, but can uh, we can lose maybe one heart, but it's also possible that the king of spades is on side. Um, I will take my chances with six spades. Of course, not sure it's good, but I think it's okay. Ah, here you see, uh, I went to the next hand. Uh, but now you see six spades is the right contract. I'm happy for a partner to bid uh, uh, four diamonds. And uh, here you can see what, uh, what's happening. You can compare. Um, you can compare to your friends. You can compare to the pros. And here uh, I'm very happy because uh, you see some relay beating of Boss and Short and they decide to end up in... Uh, in four spades. And let's go to the next one. So next one, board two, opening one diamond. On my left, one heart. Uh, two diamond, well, it's opponents to bid, so I will pass. Two diamonds is a qubit. And I expect how you you can click on it to see what it is. Invitational with three or more hearts. Well, two hearts, nothing to bid here, so I will just pass. And we will see the results. Like two hearts, it is. It's three three stars because ah, well, there's nothing we can do. I can compare. 
Uh, I can compare to the browse. I can compare to my friends. And uh, let's go to the next board. Oh, this is a nice one. One spade, one of Trump double is uh, penalty. Two clubs, but I don't really want to defend two clubs. If I pass, it depends on your agreements. So I think when boss is short bit, now they will double for takeout. But uh, I think with my partner here, because after he doubled one of Trump, every double will be uh, for penalty. Yeah, I'm a bit in doubt now. Uh, what to bid? I think I want to play this hand myself. And... Because I can pass, but then part will double and I will bid two spades anyway. So, let's be... Uh, Let's be just bidding at uh, the hands. Was not sure it's good. This is uh, this is fine, but on clubs partner would have bid uh, two spades himself. Quite an aggressive double. Well, I think it's very good because he has uh, three spades. Um, okay, one diamond pass, one heart. I bit one spade, two diamond part, and bits two hearts, which is uh, a hand too good for two spades Again, a hand too good for three spades. So now I've uh, I think I've got a great hand because two hearts is an invitational bit with spade support. So I will bid four spades directly. Because I've got an extra spade. And I will take this invitation. It will be quite a long video because we have got lots of boards. So you can just scroll through the video and see what boards you like. Uh, I will be comparing some things. Uh, and here you can see what everybody does. Uh, five times uh, in uh, north and one time in south. You can see how Boss and Shore did bid it. They have a different system. Uh, and this uh, in this system, they well, south doubles here. And here it's funny, you can compare. He was like, okay, south. He doubles, and my partner doesn't double. I think doubles uh, is better. Uh, because you've got 14 points and 4-3 four, four, in the majors. And uh, this is where you can learn from the pros. Okay, one no trump. My partner did bit two hearts. I did bit three spades, because we play a very natural system. Uh, we play just... Five card, five spades or more, and this is a forcing bid. Pardon decides to bid four spades. Passes. Okay, quite easy. Depends on the system you play, and of course you can compare this. But this hand is less interesting. So go. Let's go to the next. One club, two spades. I've got five clubs, only nine points, but. I don't need lots of points to bid three clubs here because, yeah, they they force me to it. So, but I don't. I do want to bid something because otherwise there's a quite a, uh, a d decent chance it goes pass, pass, pass. And I don't really want want that. The downside, of course, maybe partner bids now three spades with a good hand. And I will have to bid four clubs. Of partner can also maybe bid 3 now. Well, even they bid 3 spades, he bids 3 now. So now I'm happy I did bid 3 clubs. If 3 spades is good, uh, 3 now is good, of course. So let's see what happens. Well, three no is not the good contract. 
uh, Pardons got 17 points and uh, yeah, might have doubled three spades to ask for more information. Pardon decides to bid three now. Um, of course, we got the king of spades, but this time is not good, but you can see here the pros also did bid. Three no trump. So here, maybe when you're in doubt on a bidding, like should I bid three no trump or maybe should I double? Well, you can also check by other guys and, uh, well, if everybody does something different, you know you you are wrong. And here he made the, the well, the same bid as uh, I think should brink. So should always be good, I think. Okay, one club, one spade. Nothing to bid here. I will, I will pass. One of them double. Uh, will be takeouts with uh, me and my partner. Nothing special. So a uh, spade and uh, diamond and the hearts. So let's hear it for the hearts. Two hearts is uh, is a fine one. Of course, I could also pass because of I've got a reasonable hand, but partner can also do this only on distributional hands. So let's go to the next one. Hand eight, one club, one no trump, two clubs. It's just Stamon. Stamon relay, he doesn't have to have a four card in the major, can also have an eight, nine balanced. Now he has got four hearts and 10 points or something. So we will pass. Best contract is five diamonds. Okay. Mm, okay. I think I know what part of it. Maybe part of thought, well, if my if uh, uh, Tom says two hearts, I will be in uh, in uh, in hearts. And if partner bits spades, I'll be in spades. Many times I think this will be made because you don't get a spade lead, but in double dummy, it's uh, it's more often that. Uh, the pros, here you can see how Boss and Shure did bid. They have a, a, a more wider system uh, to show what they want. I don't know their system, but here you can see the pros can be in five diamonds. But not that strange, I think. I like the logic of my partner. Okay, uh, overcall of one heart. What heart I see? Well... I've got a great hand. Partner bits two clubs. So minimum will be, we, we will be, of course, in four hearts. But on two clubs, I will bid four clubs. As an extreme good hand with no clubs. I expect him to just bid four hearts and that will be the end. But I could have also bid double, I see here now. Because my hand is a bit too good for one heart. Uh, yeah, but it's it's too tricky here maybe to continue. I will be thinking a bit about it. Two clubs means 10 or more points. Um, three hearts. So when partner has either the ace or the king of spades, it will be a fine contract. I'm a bit in doubt now what to do. I'm not happy with my one heart bit. Of course, partner can have ace queen of uh, of uh, clubs and the king of hearts, but uh, this will be a bit of a gamble. Well, I just pass. I'm I'm not sure what it is. Well, it is good because partner has the king queen of clubs. So fortunately, but I can compare again. And you can see the pros. Ah, Bussy also starts with one heart. So now that I know, was not so crazy. 
two hard pass, four hard double. Uh, double is, of course, just points. Um, this is a tricky one. Partner has space. I've got three small space. Uh, I'm in doubt. I can bid four no. Asking for to play five in a minor, or I will pass uh, this double. I will pass. Let's see how this uh, ends up. Many decisions. So uh, nice one. Uh, for hard double is good. Comparing again to the pros, and they. Yeah, Buzz decided to bid uh, for now. I think it was it's a difficult decision, so I will text Bussy. He's my brother, so I can test him. Buzz, why should I bid for now? Okay, we play Lebensol, so on two note Trump, I will have to bid. I'm forced to bid three clubs here. Partner, can I have either... Um, a game forcing hand with a spade stopper, so then he will bid three no, or he can be weak in clubs or weak in diamonds, so he will pass three clubs or pass three diamonds or bid three diamonds. I have to say, uh, three spades. This is special. Ah, uh, no, I know what this is. I have to think about the, the labor soul. So in labor soul, this means, partner, I've got a spade stopper and I've got four cards in hearts. So I'll bid four hearts. Okay. So it depends on your system. I think I'm right, but I play different systems with different partners. So I think he has, yes, wow. This is a spade stopper. And most are in four hearts. So nice one. Okay, board 12. Uh, three hearts pass four hearts. I doubles. And now part of it's four spades. So I will pass. Just hoping for the best. Um, well, and now four hearts was the best uh, to... Uh, Two pass. I think four space is, uh, is okay. Yeah. Pass is short. Did bit the same way. So a hand 13, one heart, two spade, three hearts. Uh, well, three hearts is not really invitational, but, got, but we don't have uh, methods here to show invitational hands. I don't have with. Uh, with Ronald, with him, two no Trump would be natural. Um, well, so I will just bid four hearts. And that's okay. Let's go to the next one. One club, one diamond, one spade. One spade can be four because double will be four, four in the majors. And depends on your methods, of course. Again, here it's just natural. So I'll bid two spades. Four spades. The partner can decide what to do next. Four spades it is. So, of course, I will pass. And let's see what the results of the jury is. Three starts, but yeah. You see here, this is all about expected value. That one diamond double uh, is with all the cards open is slightly better. Uh, but you don't have to look at it all the time. Four spades is normal contract. You can compare it to the other players. Uh, ah, this is the, I'm sure they bit differently. Uh, they open a different system. So they open one no Trump. And uh, they open one no Trump, I think 12, 14 or something, and you get a different uh, kind of bidding. 
So not easy to compare. Next one, one heart, pass, one spade. I've got 15 points. Uh, this is a bit of a tricky one. Uh, oh yeah, I... Well, we have a, got a system, I think. I don't know if I've got a system with Ronald. When I bid two spades, uh, he can ask my hand. We don't bid Gazilli or something. So here, it's a bit tricky what I should bid. I feel two hearts is not great. Three hearts. Yeah, let's bid three hearts. That's the, the best I can do here. When you play Gazilli, it's more easy, of course. You have to do something. And I know Ronald has realized that if he have got if he has got five spades he can bid on. Ah, this is uh, too high. Three hearts. Ooh, I was uh yeah, two hearts was best. And here Rose were on three down, yeah. We don't have a really good system for this. Except in the next one. Okay. One heart, one spade, two heart, three spades. So three spades is like zero spades, but we've got a good hand, but nothing really extreme for two hearts. So I will just bid four hearts. I don't feel good enough to bid the queue. We've got all the queues, but with only six points, I'm not willing to myself run to slam, run to slam. Our partner has got difficulties. Maybe it's four space. Then I will be thinking, what can you have out? It can be slam, of course. It's possible. He's thinking. Oh, he says something to me. Oh, he says, let me think. So no problem. We've got all the time. So, and here, let's see if you can do it uh, here. You can uh, just bid and you can compare. You can compare other hands. And sometimes there are many different uh, contracts. And some, sometimes there are some. And don't worry about when, um, oh yes, for hearts. Don't worry about when um, some contract is not great and you see this kind of uh, one spade double. You don't want to be in those contracts, but it's just that the system shows with double dummy solvers what is the best one. Compare for hearts, of course, is the best one. He was really thinking about it. Uh, pushing maybe some more, but with 18 points and with partner with six to nine, an ace quick ace queen of spades is not that good because the king of spades will be offside. And he decided to do the right thing. One heart, one no trump, two club. Like I said, we don't bid gazilli, we just bid natural. So I will bid two hearts. Well, we'll which shows partner, I've got something like Five to seven points with three hearts. I didn't, uh, I can upgrade to eight, but not with Jack, 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 Jack. When Jack, 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 Jack would have been the ace, I will be upgrading. Uh, 15 points, well, four hearts is here the best. So 
No, this is uh, a hard decision uh, for Ronald, but he knows uh, I'm uh, I'm weak. Uh, and so he decided to pass. One club, one no Trump, two clubs. Okay, I've got no major, so two diamonds, two diamonds it is. Let's see what he does. When it would, would be two hearts, it's a week with both majors, two space. Yeah, okay, he does. So normally this would this would be like week with both majors. So I will pass. Uh, yes. And smaller would be three hearts. So let's see if it's good. Well, it's, it's okay. He's, uh, he's got five, five, and you can here compare it to the pros. And the pro also bits uh, a bit weak. So well, it's all good. Uh, depends on well, one oh, four hearts is a really good contract. Maybe a bridge too far. Okay, two club, two diamonds. Yeah, here you have to have um, uh, some good. Um, Things you can uh, bid. Let me think what I should bid. Um, let's see. It's best here. And so here I will bid uh, two hearts. Uh, this forces to two spades. And then I will tell my hand. So when I've got normally a game forcing hand with hearts, I will bid three hearts. And when I bid something else, I've got a two suitor. And when I bid two no trump, it shows 25 plus in uh, with a balanced hand. Doesn't happen a lot, 26 points. But this way, you can just bid uh, statement relay and you can make life easy. And you can still bid uh, like three spades in south with both minors and slam invitational. You can bid uh, on three level instead of bidding too high and not be able to explore anymore. Ronald is, is, is thinking. Like all the points. Okay. Three club is just Taemon Relay, Niemeyer like. So three spades is five spades. Okay, this is tricky because uh depends on your agreements. Uh, I think he shows uh, Q, uh, but it's also possible. Uh, so with, when I would play with my brother, this would be natural. So partner will have just clubs. Uh, but now I'm thinking what to do to see if I can, I can explore. Uh, well, it doesn't matter what it is. I will always bid four diamonds. <laughs> so it's Q. I'm just queuing with my partner. But now it's decision time because he asks with the four no, um, asks uh, 
the aces, of course, the key cards. And now I have to decide if it's for clubs or if it's for spades. I think it's for spades. Um, so I've got one, two, three, four, five. So it doesn't happen a lot, but um, it's two or five with the queen of spades. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Um, so normally you will bid like one, uh, one of, of the four, no trump, uh, one, four, uh, zero, three, two, and two with, but now it's two or five. Okay. Um, So I hope partner knows. But uh, it's a bit extreme because of the lo loads of points. I think I've never bit this with five. I went to the first time. You have to have a first time for everything. So if partner bids five, no, asks for kings. I will bid my six diamond, diamond king. And now and then he knows everything, so. It's a nice game, does that bridge? Oh, if we, we are on the same page. Yeah, five now Trump. So six dia diamonds, diamond king. So these kinds of hands will be interesting to see how Boss Insure did bid it. Well, now he yeah, he knows he knows Ace King Queen of Spades fifth. Uh, he bid seven hearts. That feels a bit strange. Um, normally, yeah, maybe he lets me. Uh, I can choose between uh, seven spades and seven of trump. Uh, but I don't really have anything extra. I did show everything: ace, king, queen of spades, ace of hearts. So uh, I will just bid seven spades. <laughs> I don't know if seven hearts might be a misclick or something. I, I'm not sure. Seven space seems to be normal. Or maybe something went wrong on in on his side. We're not on the same page. It's exciting this game. So Okay, seven now, Trump. Uh, good luck. Pass. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. I will pass for seven now. So let's see what he has. Ooh la la. Okay. He has got four hearts. So let's see what went wrong. I think I know. On three clubs, he thinks three spades shows four hearts, but three spades shows only four hearts after I did bid three diamonds. So that's why it's uh, it totally exploded the bidding. So I will call him about that and we will discuss. But well, luck is on our side because seven no Trump is uh, is the good contract. And you see, 
uh, your bus insured did bit a bit the same and decided to bid seven now. So all good. Um, board 20, one diamond, one spade, three diamonds. Ooh la la. So three diamonds is a good hand, but can also be just 15 or some, something, 15-ish. Uh, let's bid my value. I can bid my value in three hearts. I can also bid four diamonds. Is something like a Q. Mm. The problem with four diamonds is, uh, well, I will just bid four hearts because the problem with four diamonds is, uh, this is forcing, of course, uh, is that the partner can't bid club, club Q. Three no, it's all good. He get he's he's got club Q now. I know, and now I, I can either bid um, a pass, uh, four no trump, or four diamonds. Uh, I feel for four diamonds. Um, I'm in doubt. Four diamonds is a uh, slam invitational with diamonds and partner can reject with four no and can bid four hearts or four spades with a good hand. But I'm in doubt what to do. Can also just pass, then we will play three no. What would you do? I'm too good, so I'll bid four diamonds. I talk to myself like, can I pass? Well, only when a partner now bids four, no, I will be happy to pass. But these are agree agreements have to be firm. Uh, and let's bid, yeah, when partner bids Q, I will bid four, no. Asking for key cards and let's just hope for the best. Three, so one, two, three. Uh, yeah, let's just bid six diamonds. Not very confident, but hope is bad. Okay, six, no. Six diamonds is fair enough. We can compare. Well, everybody is in six diamonds. Let's see what partner had. Seventeen point, really good hands. Maybe even a bit too strong for three diamonds. So partner really was happy that I was so continuing the bidding. Okay, one heart, double, one spade, one no. Well, where are the points? Two clubs. Uh, I believe my partner. This is a bit crazy bidding, I think, but I just believe my partner and my partner shows one no, we will have a good hand with, uh, so I will bid three no Trump. Feels a bit strange because both opponents are also bidding, but... Maybe they bid on uh, unbalanced hands and, and West has a good hand. Okay. Well, good to trust my partner, being in 3 no. Uh One heart, of course. Now we pause again. Nothing to show. So as you see now, it's quite a long session, but normally when you play all the hands, you can just bid whenever you want. Now I will, uh, when it goes pass and partner doubles, uh, it's used and we've got a problem, but. Okay, now well, Houston, we don't have a problem because partner bids three clubs, let's just pass. 
Let's see what happens. Ah, they double. Wow, well, that will pass. Let's hope he didn't overbid his hands. Well, this is a bit like uh, because you've only got uh, five clubs. So the problem is with only five clubs, it's a bit trickier. Uh, and you better pass. Uh, it's very like minus 600. Uh, and here you see what they do is they um, tend to first bid it and not afterwards. It's normally when you first pass and you can bid later, it's better. But uh, on this layer, or on this uh, with only uh, five clubs, it's better to decide to bid directly or never bid. And with six clubs, you can maybe first pass and then bid three clubs. This is a bit too much, but doesn't matter. Uh, one heart, two club. Okay, two spades. No. Two no. Balanced hands. Nothing extras. Well, some less I've got. Only 11 points. And three nowadays. I will just pass. This is a fine contract. And we can also compare and see that there was and short was only in two no. Okay, two club, two spades. Well, this is a no-brainer, I think, just bidding three no. And after this board, we will know who won. We did win by three stars. So this is great, especially against these guys. So uh, I really like. Uh, but let's see here. You can uh, push this the button. And you here you can uh, compare on every board what we and she did. What we and they did. 7-0 was a bit lucky for us. This was the hand we went overboard. Where did we? Uh, here we did win a lot of uh, a lot of uh, stars. This is the hand uh, where I will call Buzz about uh, whether to bid four no or don't bid four no. And the rest is lost the same. Here you can see a difference. You can see the different biddings um, and see. Everything is side. Here, uh, Ronald is very good not to bid. And we want some news. So thanks a lot for watching. Uh, and uh, see you next time. And enjoy, enjoy the boards on Qubits.